Hey guys, Wicked here. Welcome to another Clash of Clans video. We got a Clan War recap, episode 25. Thank you for joining me, and I uh, thanks heaps for guys for supporting these Clan War recaps. It really showcases my clan and also showcases the different attack strategies that you see in Clash of Clans um, every war. So here we go. So I wanted to start from the very bottom part of the battle map and starting off with a town hall 8 we got Pickley from X Loyal uh, versus their number 18 the direct opposite and she's got a go wipe with a few witches from the clan castle troops that were donated to her uh, as usually town hall 8s don't have witches uh, so here we go so she's gone right into center she's got the good heal spell keeping those whizzies alive so the go wipe go we wipe type raids you got to make sure the wizards stay alive because they're the, your main source of firepower. And I see a lot of people uh, keep trying to heal the peckers and all that stuff, but the wizards are actually the key to your raid or getting a three star. So just keep that in mind. Um, a lot of people use a rage and heal um, without luring the clan castle troops sometimes. So that's a good tactic as well, especially if the clan castle is right in the center. And uh, it's really hard to get so um, you can use a rage and heal instead of trying to lure and killing off the clan castle troops off the side so there we go Pickley is now about to get the three star on this town all eight and well done to her so the second raid here we go we've got Lakers oh, this is this base is called the geezer and um, I've done a recent video on a go lava loon raid uh, this the, the last episode before this one um, it's a three star series uh, episode and it shows a go lava loon on this space and apparently this space is called the geezer um, it's quite popular I've seen it many times now in clan wars and um, unfortunately my clan has three starred it so many times that I think uh, people that have this space should probably change it so um, the last three star on this space from my clan was a go lava loon but this time it is just a standard Go Wee Wee. So I love my favorite tech in the whole of Clash of Clans is the Go Wee Wee, um, especially when I was Town Hall 9. And uh, so this is what uh, just a standard Go Wee Wee is some golems, wizards, and witches, and uh, the heroes as well. You got the jump spell to get into the center because that's usually where all the important defenses are, like the expos uh, um, and the Teslas, and especially the Town Hall. We want to knock out that Town Hall. And uh, as you can see, uh, Lakers has been using a rage and heal to keep those whizzies alive um, while battling those clan castle troops and once those clan castle troops are dead um, he is annihilating that center now he's got his zeros in there he's got everyone in there and they're just shooting outwards um, shooting there uh, um, from inside to out and uh, it's pretty brutal um, once everything it, brutal like the uh, the expos and all that are dead so we've got a few uh, Wizards on the outside with a few witches. The witches are great because they spawn those skeletons and they distract um, those single target defenses really well. Uh, not so much the splash damage defenses like the wizard towers and the mortars, but um, the archer towers and cannons. Those archer, and ta archer towers and cannons are shooting those skeletons all day, just all day, and that's what keeps your troops, other troops, alive um, much longer. And um, especially the heroes. Heroes get. Um, pretty much covered by those uh, Larrys that are protecting them and here we go so we've got the uh, Archer Queen by herself she's very low health at the moment but the uh, defenses are shooting at that golem and we've got some wizards and witches uh, down on the northeast area uh, coming towards the north and we've only got an Archer Tower and Wiz Tower left and we got it's pretty safe now that um, that it's gonna be a three star we've got the Archer Queen coming from behind to knock out uh, those structures and those golems are tanking very well there's a whiz tower is not very effective against a golem um, especially because it's a splash damage a very low splash damage um, tr uh, defense and golems have a lot of high health and one of the golems actually hasn't uh, broken into two yet and the, uh, the Archer Queen just knocked out the whiz tower and there we go there's a three star from Lakers all right, here we go. Here's um, a Goho Wee Wee. So we've got a bit of a uh, one of those unique raid type um, raids again. Um, he's luring with the giant. So the good thing about this raid at the, at the moment is he's luring the clan castle troops, and he also tripped those double giant bombs that were clearly there. You could tell where the double giant bombs are, and if they're there, the double giant bombs on the other side will be ex in exactly the same spot. So. 
So he's tripped those double giant bombs and now he's lured the clan cast troop to the northern corner um, as I believe he wants to get those other double giant bombs and take care of the archer queen with the golem. So there we go, the golem is in now. Um, he's doing a little bit of a clearing uh, for the golems and he's going to break through that wall very soon. I believe the wall breakers did not make the break so he's sending in the he his heroes early. Uh, those wizards on the outside are shooting down those elixir collectors so there's no um, distractions to go around the outside. And now the golem is in, the archer queen is dead, um, the king is clearing and also tripped those double giant bombs in the way for the hogs to come in and uh, start their little hog heal action. So pretty much once every the arch queen is dead, the clan castle troop is dead and the double giant bombs are taken care of, uh, the heal spells and the hogs will just annihilate the, this base. So as long as the heal spells are well placed then you have no worries. So here we go, James he's got one heal spell left, uh, he's got a, two groups of hogs um, clearing the defences now, so once the defences are, go defenses are gone um, the hogs will turn onto just the normal structures. So he's got one heal spell left and he's got heaps of hogs left so he's going to place that last heal spell where they uh, merge together and um, that is the last of the defences there and I will shortly fast forward this after they kill the BK and BK is about to go down and boom. So there we go, let's just fast forward the clear up and that's a very good go ho wee wee by James. Uh, well done dude, uh, 3 star under your belt. And here we go, so we decided to display one of my attacks. Um, so I went for their number 3, the guy that was a bit higher than me. I decided to lure this clan castle um, as I was, I'm just actually doing a clean up attack. Um, the other person that attacked this one got a 0 star. But I, I learnt from what the other guy did and I lured the clan castle troops because there's there's four Teslas and um, Infernos uh, in front of that clan castle and uh, trying to kill the clan castle troops at the same time as trying to battle the Infernos and Teslas, my troops just wouldn't last. So I decided to do uh, a bit of a go wee wipe, um, I've used three peckers and uh, some witches in my um, clan castle troops to kill their clan castle and watch out how I freeze um, that archer tower, inferno tower and the tesla and the other side I do the two teslas, inferno tower and the archer tower and uh, so that's pretty cool. So I've already got 42% at this stage uh, I had another free spell, I should, probably should have uh, freeze the level 3 inferno instead of the level 2 but it, you know it, it works, whatever um, knocked out the town hall and now only got 2% to go. We've got the king still alive and the arch queen and we've got a rage spell so I put the rage spell down um, just for shits and gigs to uh, you know so I just made sure that I made uh, used all my potions. <laughs> there we go guys so that is a 2 star on their number 3 and the last raid is against their number 1, uh, our number 3 against their number 1 using a quad uh, lava Love Lunion, Quad Love Lumi, Quad Quad Love Lunion. I don't know how to say it. Whatever. So have watch the uh, hogs. Uh, sorry, hogs. <laughs> watch the uh, lava hounds go in now. They've uh, already broken apart into lava pups. And uh, watch the town hall. Actually, I think the town hall actually gets uh, destroyed by the uh, balloons crashing down when the when the defenses are shooting them down. So the so the damage that the town hall actually got was um, from the loon damage, so um, wow that's awesome. <laughs> so at this stage he's only got 36%, he got the first star, um, now he's got a few clearing minions and he's got his heroes to make that, uh, to make that 50% star. So he's got a bit of a problem here, he's got the wizards um, coming towards that minion and blasts them. So he's, he d did destroy that builder hut for an extra percentage on that side. Now he's got a minion on the other side shooting that spell factory. That brings it up to 39%. He's got the Arch Queen now. His Arch Queen is killing off those wizards. Now he's got the 40%. And now that Arch Queen should get around 45, you know, 46%. Um, around those uh, those collectors around there. So he's got the Barbarian King Arch Queen to deal with over there. He's got minions on the right hand side. One minion actually died too close to the Arch Tower. The other one gets too close to the Arch Tower, but now he's at 47%. Um, the Queen is shooting at their Queen. 
Shoot, got, gets the 49%, the queen is going down, but Lucky's got the BK to get that 50%. So the score is 52 to 33 to X Loyal. They kind of gave up after a while. This is what the damage they gave to us. They actually had 129 war wins, and uh, we were expecting a lot bigger of a battle. So there we go. They didn't really clean us up very well. Um, leaving a lot of Town Hall 8s and Town Hall 9s unfinished. He's got two, we two starred most of the Town Hall 10s. Um, a few Town Hall 9s got away, but uh, as you go down further, uh, probably 10 and onwards, um, we pretty much 3 starred um, every single base. So uh, there we go, we have X Loyal versus Oz Imbativis. I don't know how you say it. 5233. Hope you guys enjoy. Smack that like button if you did. Subscribe to my channel if you're new, and I'll see you guys next episode.